If you would like to book a personal tarot reading with me, I offer same-day personal tarot card readings for $20. You receive your reading the same day of your purchase. Everything you need to know of details is in the description box below of this video of how to book with me. Thank you so much. Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here, for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val 333 Tarot and with Spirit. And we're just going to jump right in here and see what does Spirit want to tell you the most today in regards to your current situation. All right, this is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, in the North Node, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. And what else here? Oh, I do offer same-day personal readings for $20. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you, Taurus. All right. Right, Taurus. Right now you're just hanging on to stuff. You're working on some stuff, you know, budgeting, building, saving, creating, thinking about money and finances and business and what more you could do. Okay. I don't know what happened there. I'm going to say you're just obsessed with money and material and wealth. And I don't even know if it's really, truly toxic. You know what I mean? I think you're just obsessed, which I mean, on one hand, is that really a bad thing? I mean, I don't think so. Uh, you know, you get a little, you get real devilish. <laughs> all right you know so i whatever you got your own reasons why you're in the devil energy i kind of can't really say it's too early to say if it's anything genuinely toxic i just think it's kind of like you know you like money you like material you like wealth and you're trying to figure out how the hell to do it you know we'll see more here i mean like i said you have your own reasons you got you, you can be in your own addictions you got your own obsessions your own problems but you're gonna still stay in it you know it and it is what it is Yeah, I think you're just obsessed with your plans. You're like, no, I got to figure out what the hell I got to do to keep things going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I kind of think it's more so just like literally planning in business and trying to figure out some things that you got to do for yourself. That's really what I what I kind of sense here from it. Okay. Yeah, I think you're just obsessed with trying to figure out some stuff with plans. I don't really think it's like genuinely like toxic, toxic. Yeah, literally. You're just like, yeah, I'm investing, I'm working, I'm creating, I'm saving, I'm budgeting, I'm working on things I got to work on. Yeah, you're figuring out some things here, as you would with multiple investments, multiple sources of income possibly too. Yeah, okay, but it looks like you, you know, you doing the work realistically to figure out what it is you can do for yourself is what's helping you to um realize here there's a new beginning a new chapter there is something here that makes you feel extremely passionate okay With whatever that may be yeah and that is oh okay so you're either feeling passionate about who okay a few things here you yourself on your own journey and your own path okay whether you're if you're single you feel very aligned you're having a good time living your single life okay um, or you're excited to truly commit to someone. Maybe you're in love with a best friend or you are in a relationship or a marriage. Or you have passion because of a, you know, a relationship outside of you. Maybe you care for them, you like them, they help you or whatever. So either or. Yeah, okay, it's business. For the majority of you, I kind of sense it's like you yourself, like doing what you do for you, for you, what makes you feel good and aligned when it comes to your business, your level of success, career path, money, how hard you're willing to work with that. Yeah, that makes you feel really good. Um, emotionally authentic, you, you know, you being you. So, okay, some of you are saying that you make money off of you being you literally. It feels good. It's a good feeling. There's a level of success you're heading towards, you know? Yeah, it makes you feel genuinely really good and loving and emotional and nurturing with yourself and with others around you. Being very friendly. Mm -hmm. That is helping you to kind of do some research and study and plan and figure out what it is you'd like to do in life here. Okay. Some of you may be inspired by, inspired by a female, like you watching a female helps you get inspired by what you want to do for your job. Like I'm kind of getting more content creator people, 
like you see, you know, vloggers or something and you know, maybe you could be a vlogger or something and you're like, oh, okay, I like what she's doing. Let me try that. You know what I mean? So either or, just an example, it's not for all of you. Yeah, literally, you're like, well, what? you're like, well, actually, Val, yes, <laughs> that's exactly what it is. Now, for some of you, it's that. Others of you, it's kind of like you doing the research and the study helps you to keep that status, keep that wealth, keep your image up. You keep that going. There's a lot of abundance. There's a lot of love and rebirth, okay, with you. Some of you, congratulations, you are pregnant. Others of you, it's not that. Now, I don't know what happened here. Either you want all that to be remain hidden, but too much got revealed of information, and or it's a mystery, like, is it a boy, is it a girl? You know what I'm saying? For some of you, if it's kids. Mm, you, or some of you just want your status to kind of, like, remain a bit hidden. You want to you wanna just remain a bit more mysterious in life. So either or here. Oh, God. Okay. Well, okay. Something. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Uh, I don't know what happened here, Taurus. Now, okay. So what happened? Hmm. <sighs> Something went sour, and I mean real fast, real freaking fast. I don't know what happened there. Did I say too much? I don't know. Were you really studying and spying, uh, spying on someone for the sake of ideas? And now you're like, how the hell did that come out? Hey, I'm I, I'm just reading what I see in the cards, okay? I, hey, do what you need to do. People do that to make a living now. So I, I'm not judging you or knocking it down, but now you're like, well, what the hell? So either you're pissed off now at yourself or at someone, or maybe you got in a random argument or fight with someone here. There's a lot of aggression and frustration and irritation. And now things are getting so revealed in a shocking way. You're like, what the hell? So a lot is happening now. A lot of changes are going on here. While you're at home, okay, you're kind of losing it at home right now, but that's fine. Things are still stable there. It could be with who you live with too for some of you here. Okay, it's because of a message Maybe you're texting someone or laying a message or, you know, something's getting revealed. Now, you do still feel pretty inspired and motivated to do something or say something here. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Because of a message, now you're like, well, crap, now I got to walk away from that financial opportunity. Hmm, Taurus. Okay. Well, damn. It's almost like you, ah, uh, Yeah. Something or someone, because something got said, now you're like, I can't do that now. And now I feel like crap. And now I don't know what to do for money and finances. And I mean, just do what you got to do, Taurus. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, oh God, you're facing judgment about this. That's what's going on here. Okay. You're understanding what you did and what the reality of your life. Okay. Oh, no, Taurus. Okay, now you're guarded. Now you're like, screw this. Okay, now you're too defensive and guarded in, in this reading, and I can't really break through to you now and talk to you because you're... Ah, uh, I struck a nerve. Okay. Well, we'll leave it there, Taurus. Uh, I hope you figure out what you got to do here. Um, hmm. Okay, well, you could be dealing, if you are dealing with anyone, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. All right, thank you. Bye.